My name is Beston. I live in Cape Town. Also, I do uh, delivery. Interbed helped me to realize my dreams. Now I have my own delivery vehicle and I'm able to do the removal in and around Cape Town. Welcome to the Suggested Bet segment for Wednesday the 14th of August where we race on the poly track at Hollywood Bets Gravel. Uh, please go on to the race by race preview that I did with Sheldon Peters if you want to listen in to uh, the uh, selections uh, from races 1 through to race number 8 with some good value that was found on the show. But bring up uh, my suggested bet. Well, it's going to be very simple. I think this looks to be uh, a very uh, interesting card because over the weekend I did mention that I think the exotics will pay well on the competitiveness of that race car that we had. But it didn't turn out that way because there were lots of winners in the Pick 6. Uh, the Pick 6 paid 11000 In fact, there was a Hollywood Bets Punters Challenge winner, Cape to Cairo, that won uh, to be an 8 from 8. So. Whilst it may look tricky uh, in black and white, if things fall into place, there is money to be made, and that was the case over the weekend. Well, I think that this uh, race meeting, being the first local race meeting for the new week, with no racing on Monday and Tuesday, should attract some very decent pools and respectable pools at that. And I'm certain that all these exotics will pay well. But I've gone to try and bank some cash early on in the meeting and taking on some strongly fancied favorites with a pick three that will begin in race number one. And in leg number one, it's going to be number one, record high. Number two, Mac Dazzler. That's been backed anti-post. And horse number seven, wherever I lay my hat to, I think is a big value in the race. If that has to arrive in leg one of that pick three, that will already grow into a very decent dividend. So numbers one, two, and seven there. Race number two, what I've done there is numbers five, six, and eight. Uh, five is an odds on shot deception lats that also been backed anti post on the fixed odds betting market, odds on eight to ten. But we're going to take the visitor on. We'll have to do the traveling first run on the poly track with number six, turn around. And again, I think horse number eight. Uh, is big value at around 10 to 1 at the time of recording. Isi Quishi Quishi from the stable of Allison Wright's yard. So numbers 5, 6 and 8 there. And if uh, 7 has to win leg 1 and 8 has to win leg 2, then we're sitting in the pound seats coming into race number 3. Because here I think we're well covered with numbers 3, 4, 8 and 10. Uh, sorry, numbers 2, 4, 8 and 10. Uh, 2 being Burning Man, 4, uh, Bellas Pablo, Horse number eight, which is into a spirit, and number 10, Red Mountain. So two, four, eight, and 10. If we multiply that out, three times three, which is nine, and nine times four, which is 36 Rand. So we're playing for the result there in that first pick three on the card. Again, a big thank you to Sheldon Peters for that race by race preview, to the Gallup TV team, and from myself, Dees Darnan, to you, the valued racing fan. Have a blast, find all the winners, and hopefully it turns out to be a wonderful profitable day for you if you are racing at Hollywood Bets Gravel on this Wednesday on the Poly Track. Until we meet again, you take care. Salani Ashley. My name is Beston. I live in Cape Town. And also, I do uh, delivery. Interbet helped me to realize my dreams. Now I have my own delivery vehicle and I am able to do the removal in and around Cape Town.